Vigorous exercise such as running has a number of positive effects, including the opportunity to lose overall body fat. If you're wondering whether you'll get a flatter chest as a result of your efforts on the treadmill, the answer is yes, as long as you're not overindulging. How you lose fat To lose fat, you have to create a caloric deficit, meaning you have to burn more calories than you consume. When you perform activities such as running on a treadmill, you raise your heart rate and burn more calories than you would by just doing the activities of daily living. When you create a calorie deficit, you'll tend to lose fat all over your body. Running on the treadmill then can result in fat loss not only in the chest but all over the body. To lose one pound of fat on the body, you have to burn 3,500 more calories than you consume. Calorie burn on the treadmill If you've chosen running as your way of burning calories, you've chosen something that tends to be a relatively big calorie burner. Heavier people will burn more calories than lighter people, and of course, you will burn more calories the faster and longer you run. Running at a pace of 5.2 miles per hour or an 11.5 minute per mile pace will help a 155 pound person burn 355 calories in 30 minutes according to Harvard Heart Publications. If that person speeds up to a pace of 6.7 miles per hour or a 9 minute per mile pace, she will burn about 409 calories in 30 minutes. Compare that to a 185 pound person who will burn 500 calories at 5.2 miles per hour and 488 calories at 6.7 miles per hour. Tracking calories If you want to lose that chest fat, use an online caloric needs estimator to determine how many calories you need to consume to maintain your weight. Count your daily intake minus the number you burn from running to determine whether you're creating that calorie deficit. If, on the other hand, you don't want to lose girth around your chest, be sure you're consuming the number of calories necessary to maintain your weight plus the number of calories you're burning off throughout running. For example, say you determine that you need to consume 2000 calories to maintain your weight. If you run on the treadmill for 30 minutes and burn roughly 400 calories, you will need to consume 2400 calories that day in order to maintain your weight and avoid creating a calorie deficit. Fat Accumulation and Gender How much fat you might lose in your chest area is a matter of gender. Women tend to store more overall body fat than men, and a good deal of that fat is stored in the breast area. Men will store fat in that area too, but generally in lower proportions than women. After menopause, women tend to gain even more fatty tissue in the breast, as the ducts and lobules necessary for breastfeeding are no longer needed. With that in mind, don't expect uniform changes across the board in terms of fat loss in the chest. Younger women may tend to maintain more mass in that area even while maintaining a regular exercise routine, while older women and men may be more prone to quicker fat loss in that area. Till I get up, time is barely on our side